Yeah, I'm Jason Cook, and uh, this is my Chevy G20 uh, high top we just picked up uh, about a year and a half ago, and good for road trips and rolling around the country, having fun at these van ends and every, anywhere else we might find, you know? So it's, uh, again, Chevy G20, and we've run some power. I've run cables down through it and uh, run them along the frame. We've got a 3,000 watt inverter, a couple of couple of marine batteries in the back and you know so we got power we can rough it wherever we go so yeah we've uh, you know I've been watching a lot of videos here from uh, JJ lightning here he's been giving me a lot of good tips and all that and we tried uh, running a AC uh, unit inside and it's good for camping and stuff if you've got the power to run it but we've got a got the 3000 watt inverter and it was just not enough we even it was draining the batteries even off the uh, alternator running down the road so not the best idea but inside we've uh, we just run a few fans and everything for now got a couple clip-on fans up in the back they're directional and give you a little airflow up there. Yeah, a little bit of storage. We're thinking about, you know, tearing it out and getting some better storage. A little bit, you know, the bed's nice. We uh, just kind of extended the seat and added a mattress on top of it. So we got a queen size bed, nice and comfortable. Mm -hmm. Keep our cooler and everything under the fuzzy carpet. That's always good. Everybody likes that. And Carpeted and chairs, captain's chairs. Yep storage up here absolutely took the TV out and just ran some storage and everything you know mm -hmm. you're out roaming around you don't need a TV <laughs> okay yeah we got the pop-out windows all the way around so and spare tire and ladder yep If you get yourself a high top, just remember it's like waxing and cleaning a second car. <laughs> yeah, it was a pretty simple setup. Just ran uh, ran cables with some fuses front and back. And uh, what we did was put a switch up here in the side. So when we're running down the road, I can flip the switch to charge it. And uh, then that runs into the battery. We've, like I said, 3,000 watt inverter and stuff. Always keep your toolbox and everything in case anything does happen. But mm -hmm. yeah, it's uh, good for road tripping and just having a good time. No better way to travel. So, and that's my van.